Last year we told you about a woman in Manatee County training dogs to sniff out the coronavirus. Well, you may start seeing them sniffing around soon. Yeah, the Miami Heat were actually the first team in our state to use these COVID sniffing dogs last week to allow fans into a game. Now some of our local teams could be barking up that same tree. 10 Tampa Bay reporter Leah Fernandez tells us it's all to add an extra layer of safety. These dogs can do more than your average trick. They're really special. These dogs sniff out COVID. Heather Junqueda is the founder of Biosent. She says they breed dogs specifically for scent detection work. They um, have an incredible sense of smell. They see the world by smell where we see the world by sight. Heather's training 64 dogs right now. She's using beagles and testing out beagle basset hound mixes. The goal with these dogs is to try to get the nose of the basset hound with the drive of the beagle. They train them using samples like sweat or a face mask from someone who has tested positive for COVID. We train the dogs to identify that odor amongst control odors. So we also get samples from people who have the flu or have a common cold. She says the goal is to use these dogs as a screening tool at big events. This can be a way to help people just feel more secure and being able to go out and go to events. Heather says she's already had success using them at a gymnastics event with over 400 people. She even offered them up to be used at the Super Bowl. I think it was probably too short of a time frame, but absolutely if they change their minds, we have 10 dogs that are ready to go. So you may not see these dogs at the Super Bowl, but some other teams plan to put them to good use. We're in talks with a couple different teams in the NFL and also talking with some Major League Baseball teams. Heather says she's also starting to collaborate with USF. Putting a couple different studies together and one of our goals is to do a deal with a local sports team to be able to screen fans coming in and then kind of track how that process goes.